What's up everyone? So this is my very first vlog post and uh, with a little help from Liquid Courage alcohol, I have decided to share something about myself that not a lot of people know about. So um, I will just come right out and say it. I am bisexual and to start off my sort of journey, I guess, is um, we will go back to 2015. Um, much before that, my marriage to my wife had not been so good. And I've always been a curious about my sexuality, but I've never acted on it. I've always, you know, been that straight guy and I had never acted on it but in 2015 I decided that I was going to try and talk to people who were experiencing the same difficulties as me and when I did my wife found out and she left me I was depressed for some time and just, I literally wanted to die. And it's just, it's never a good feeling for those who have gone through depression. And the fact that I wanted to die, I just felt like there was nothing out there for me. I felt like since that marriage, I could never love again. And my life was pretty much over. I dropped about 15 pounds in weight because I wasn't eating and I was sleeping too much. I would go to work and then I'd come home, take care of my dogs, and then I would sleep and try and hide the pain by sleeping. And the days would pass by fast and that was good for me. That was 2015. 2015, October, I went on deployment. I was still depressed, but my brothers in the Marine Corps, they, they helped me get through things. They didn't know anything, but they helped me get through things. And I, I owe them my life for that deployment to help me get through the, the tragedy and, and just the hurt and the depression. Fast forward over to 2016 I got back from deployment 2016 I started to discover who I truly was and I talked to plenty of people and I got let's say like the idea of what a bisexual man was and I learned what I truly wanted was and I met someone who was just like me who was scared to talk about who they were and just wanted someone to talk about just wanted someone to talk about what was going on in their lives and how they felt we met up for lunch one time and we started to become friends and from becoming friends, I started to, to develop feelings for him. And that's where I am right now. We'll fast forward a little bit. And currently right now, I am in love with a man. And even though the Bible may say it's wrong and society may say it's wrong, you can't, a human can't help who they love. And I fell in love with this person. And I just feel it's time to come clean about who I have discovered who I am and who I'm gonna remain to be and what my feelings are and what I 
am comfortable with. And to be honest, I, I don't care what anybody thinks. I don't. If someone doesn't want to be my friend because of who I am, then they were just never a real friend to begin with. And I'm okay with that. I've made some real good friends over the years and over the past couple deployments. And I've learned that if you can't make yourself happy, nobody else is gonna be there to do it. And there's, there's nobody else in the world that can make you happy except for yourself and the person you love. And I'm not gonna mention his name, but for the first time in my life, I have fallen in love with a dude. And society and the Bible may be against it, but I'm not against it. This is who I am. And I'm, I am happy once again. I was happy before with my wife and figuring out who I really am, which is a bisexual male. I, I found someone else and this is truly the person that I really do want to spend the rest of my life with. I know we'll come over complications about children and about life and society and what they think, what a couple should be, but I'm, I'm ready to take on those challenges. And I know he is too. And I won't mention any names because I know that this is a difficult time for him too, but I really am tired of hiding and I just want the world to know who I really am and that this is who I'm going to stay. And yeah, that's that's basically all it was and I'm happy. I'm finally happy after a couple years of being depressed and literally just wanting to die and disappear. And I've found happiness again. And it's wonderful. No matter what it is, no matter who it's with, no matter what type of sexuality it is and what it goes against, I'm, I'm truly happy and I hope that other people are happy for me too. And if you're not, then, I mean, that's, a, that's, that's you. But I'm happy and I'm not gonna let anybody change that for me. But that's all I've got.